all right guys on today's video we are on the nintendo 3ds today i'm going to be showing you how you install the twilight menu uh now for a little bit more information of what the twilight menu does so twilight menu plus plus is an open source menu that is able to launch a variety of applications with themes skins folders and other features this is a perfect all-in-one replacement menu for the Nintendo DS and 3DS family of systems. Uh, so now to get to the download page, it's on GitHub. Uh, this is version uh, 27.8.0 by Rocket Robs. This is the very latest version. So for the download link, just scroll down on the page to the assets section and then download the Twilight menu slash 3DS 7-zip folder. You're going to have to unzip it using 7-zip or WinRAR. So now here's the uh, download folder, unzipped on the left, and then on the right, it's my 3DS's SD card. Um, all you got to do is select all the folders, and drag and drop them to the root of your 3DS's SD card. Um, then take the twilightmenu.cia folder into the CIAs. And then as for ROMs, go into the ROMs folder. And then under NDS, this is where you add your uh, DS ROMs. And then for any other system that you want to add ROMs for, uh, all the folders have already been created for you. I'm going to be leaving you a link to my page in the pinned comment. Where you're going to get all the information you're going to need. So just find the wallpaper to this video. So there's the download link. And then a whole bunch of information. So that's basically it for the setup of the SD card. Now we're going to get on the 3DS. I'm going to show you how to install the application and a little bit of gameplay. All right, guys, now over on the uh, 3DS or 2DS uh, to install the application, we're going to be using FBI. So we just go to FBI. Select your SD card. Go down to your CIAs. And then select the twilightmenu.cia. Um, I've already done this step. So I'm going to go back. Go back. Press start. Um, and then it's going to show you that you're going to have a folder to unwrap. So there it is. Twilight Menu by Rocket Robs. So now all you got to do is unwrap it. There you go. Twilight Menu. Now we're going to start it, go to open, uh, this might take a little bit on the uh, first load, so there you go, so touch the screen, there's a twilight menu. So there you go. So this is going to take you into your folders. Uh, all you got to do is scroll over to your NDS. So there's the NDS folder. Press A. And this is going to have all your DS ROMs. So to start them, just uh, press A. If this is the first time loading, it's going to take a little bit longer. So just give it a second. So there you go. NDS bootstrap. So there you go. That loaded right up. So now if you want to load another game without exiting to the main menu, uh, you hold the 
uh, left trigger down on the D-pad and then the select button. That takes you into this menu. Now you're going to go to quick game, press A. Now I should just take you back to the Twilight menu and then you can uh, pick another game. Much easier than going back to the main menu. So there you go, it takes you back. Um, if you want to select any other systems, just go back. And then here's all the ROM folders. So let's select Game Boy Advance. So I got a few different games. Let's see if Mario Kart Super Circuit will load. Press A. This uses GBA Runner 2. So there you go to exit, same thing. Left trigger, down and select. Press the home button. Close software. Now it should take you back to the main menu. So there you go, that's how you install the Twilight menu on the 3DS or the 2DS models. I will leave all the links you're gonna need in the pinned comment. I hope you enjoy the video. Please like, comment, and subscribe. And on to the next one.